Hey everyone! So today I have a tutorial for you all on the look that I'm wearing right now. It's kind of my uh, holiday Christmas inspired tutorial um, with the really dark uh, ombre lips with the dark red and uh, a very pronounced inner corner highlight on the eyes using the um, using the Stiller Magnificent Metals uh, eyeshadows which are fantastic for the holidays because they uh, they give a really nice glitter, a really nice shimmer and that's really appropriate around um, around Christmas and New Year's. So yeah, the, um, the lips were a bit more work than I anticipated but I really like the way that they turned out and if you guys like the look keep watching bye so i'm going to start out with my laura mercier uh foundation primer just the uh regular one there's an oil free version too if you're prone to breakouts i like this one because it sits really nicely under the foundation that i'm going to use okay and just blending that in with fingers now for foundation i'm going to go with the YSL Youth Liberator Foundation. Um, I am in between colours at the moment, so I'm going to take a mix of B20, so one pump of that, and uh, B40. So I'm just mixing that on my fingers, and then what I'll do is I'll dot it on my face, and then I'll take a brush and blend it out. So just taking my Marc Jacobs Face 2 brush and blending that one in. This is a beautiful dewy finish foundation, but I find if you don't use a relatively moisturizing primer underneath, it will actually cling to dry spots. And then for concealer, I'm going to take my Makeup Forever Full Cover. I like this one because it doesn't crease under the eyes either. I'm just taking a small amount of that, I'm going to blend that one in with my MAC 224. I'm just going to pop it under the eyes, around the nose, kind of the chin and mouth area as well. So next I'm going to take a blush. This is the Maybelline Dream Bouncy blush in number 40 and that one is Pink Plum. I'm taking that one on my MAC 130 brush and just blending that one into the cheeks. This one gives really subtle colour and I just want a subtle colour on the cheeks. Reason being this look is going to be more about the lips than the face products or the eye product. I'm going to uh, set everything with the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powder in Dim Light and that's just going to give everything a really nice glow. And I'm going to follow that up with the uh, Bare Minerals Well Rested under the eyes just on the 165 tapered face brush from MAC. And next up I'm just going to fill in my brows with my Anastasia uh, Brow Powder Duo and that is in Caramel. So I'm just combing my brows out with a spoolie wand and then just taking my Inglot Angled Brush, just brow brush, and uh, popping that through the brows. Now the powder in comparison to the dip brow that I used in my last tutorial, the powder gives a little bit more of a natural finish, for me anyway. And now I'm just going to take my NARS Pro Prime and pop that one on the lids just to prevent any creasing. Next I'm going to follow up on my eyes with a Dior 5 colour design uh, quintet. Um, this is in amber design. Okay, So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the lightest colour out of the palette and pop that one all over the lids. Then I'm going to take the uh, the middle colour, the gold kind of colour, and I'm going to pop that one through the centre part of the lid. Okay. 
here. And this is all using the same brush. Uh, this is the NARS 13 brush, the blending brush. I'm just blending out the edges of that. Okay, so I'm just taking some of that darker colour and I'm going to pop that kind of along along the lash line kind of area and the outer corner. And I'm just blending all of that out with the same brush, it's the NARS number 13 tapered brush. I'm just going to take a little bit of the uh, gold and just still pop that back through the center and taking some of that inner corner color and just touching that up as well just to kind of brighten the eyes a little. Then for the bottom lash line I'm going to take my uh, 239 brush and I'm going to take that uh, gold color I'm going to pop that all over the bottom lash line with a bit of that darker colour just in the outer part of the bottom lash line. Then on a MAC 208 brush I'm going to take uh, the liner colour which is kind of like a gel cream liner and I'm going to do a slight wing with that on the upper lash line. Next up I'm going to take one of the Stila Magnificent Metals in Metallic Pixie Dust. I'm going to take that on the Stila number 37 brush which is made, well it's like a rubber thing that's made specifically for these shadows. And I'm taking some of the product and I'm going to pop that on the inner corner and just underneath the eye to add a little bit of sparkle for the holidays. <laughs> I love it. It's like Tinkerbell came and threw up all over my eyes. Then I'm going to curl my lashes and I'm going to take my Dior It Lash Mascara uh, just all over the top lashes and then my Clinique Bottom Lash Mascara all over the bottom lashes. Okay, and I'm just going to pop on some individual flares onto the outer corners of my eyes. So I'm just taking my Duo Adhesive and just popping a little bit of that on the back of my hand. So just a tiny little dab. Then I'm just going to take one lash at a time and just pop a couple on the outer on the outer corners. And next I'm going to go for the lips. So I'm going to start out with a burgundy lip pencil from MAC. I'm just going to line my lips. And next I'm taking a Diva from MAC as well this dark kind of red colour okay so I've got the lip colour on, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take all the extra off from the inside there otherwise it does smear all over your all over your teeth and it's really obvious with a dark colour like this. It's not overly fun to do to stick your finger in your mouth, but it works. Uh, next, just to get kind of a little bit of depth on the outer corners, I'm going to take a black eyeliner. This is the, um, the Rimmel Exaggerate eyeliner. And I'm just going to define the outer corners of the lips. 
And I'm just going to blend that in with a small brush, the uh, 228 from MAC. Okay, and then just taking a little extra of the Diva and uh, just kind of blending that in. Okay, and I'm just taking a tiny bit of concealer and just tidying up the lip line there. Okay, that was more work than I anticipated it to be, but I think, I think the outcome was alright. <laughs> it's uh, festive, to say the least. And that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the look. Um, one thing that kind of, I, there were two things that kind of got cut out of the video, um, just because my card ran out of memory and I didn't realise. I trimmed a couple of the lashes so they blended so they got longer towards the outside and then I, with my lips I kind of dabbed the center with my finger just to remove a little bit of product and uh, get that really nice ombre look going. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial. Let me know if you want more holiday tutorials for both Christmas and New Year and I'll be happy to do them for you and I'll talk to you all later. Bye!